If you mix Christmas with Halloween and throw in the Beta Breakers race, what you'll get is the annual Dance Along Nutcracker, the annual San Francisco Yuletide tradition put on by the San Francisco Lesbian Gay Freedom Band, where you, the audience, can not only watch them perform Tchaikovsky's Nutcracker Ballet, but dance to it as well. The San Francisco Chronicle calls this unique send-up of the Nutcracker the plum of the holiday season. With me in the studio are two of the band members, Heidi Beeler and Doug Litwin. Heidi, Doug, it's good to have you guys on. It's great to be here. Thank you. And you brought the band mascot, Sammy. <laughs> He's a star of the show, too. Yes. <laughs> he even so, has a tutu. Yeah. yeah. So tell us exactly what happens in the, the, the Dance Along Nutcracker. How does it work? It's just like what it sounds. Basically, the band plays uh, music from Tchaikovsky's Nutcracker Suite, and the audience gets out there with their tutus and their costumes and they just live it up and dance along to the Nutcracker music. And it's, uh, it's just a lot of fun. In fact, it's really hard to, keep, uh, to get the kids to sit back down again for the parts where they're watching the show. What has uh, made the Dance Along Nutcracker so successful all these years? This is the 25th anniversary of the first show. So we've been doing it for quite a while. It's evolved a lot over the years um, for the past at least 10 years, we've changed the theme every year. We've done scary bah humbug ones. We had one starring rats, and uh, we've been to outer space. So every theme is different, and this year will be no exception. Right, this year it's Dance Along Nutcracker at Sea. And so uh, basically the audience is going to come on board a cruise ship and they're going to be taken out on the seven seas with uh, Captain Stewing. I believe there's going to be a little bit of a send up uh, about the love boat and we have our love boat prop here. Um, there's going to be uh, music from the Titanic, from the Poseidon Adventure. We've got a version of the Good Ship Lollipop. So there's going to be all kinds of crazy deck side shenanigans, I'm sure. We've got them. a clip reel that we want to show you. Tell us a little bit about this. Well, here actually the band members dress up in costume. For the second half. That's right. So you're seeing clarinets dressed up like cowboys from last year. There's Sammy. Oh, there's Sammy. We weren't lying that he's <laughs> the in the show. costume fell off. <laughs> and and this is you. the band members in costume entering from last year. And these are some of the cast dancers. And well, here we have... This is from Ratified. Up oh, there's you. there you are. That's right. That's 2007. Oh, the, I, I screamed when I saw that. <laughs> that was Bruce. Oh, remember this? Oh, yes. That was the, we were the Von Trapp nuns, basically, from The Sound of Music. Oh, oh, the I'm higher Doug. the hair, the closer to God. <laughs> That's you, Doug. Yes. <laughs> oh, yes, I guess I have big hair there, too. Yep. Yeah, the trumpets like yep. to wear giant hats every year. <laughs> so tell us why um, parents should bring their kids to the Dance Hall Nutcracker. It is a perfect event for kids. I mean, it's one of the few events where kids, you don't have to force the kids to sit in chairs. They actually get to jump out of their seats and run around and play. And it's great for the parents too because they get to be in a safe space and know their kids are having a lot of fun and maybe let a whole lot of people be babysitters for an afternoon, so. Doug, this year is the first time you're having a grown-ups version. Tell us a little bit more about that. Actually, when the show started in 1985, it was all kind of a grown-up show. Um, it was put on by a group in the gay community for the community, and that was our audience. And all the shows were at night, and we were catering to that community, a lot of adults. Over the years, it started to catch on with young families and children, and that's when all the kids started showing up. So the show has evolved over the years, and now three of the four shows are daytime shows because all the families with the kids. And the evening show is a chance for the older kids, if you will, the adults, uh, to cut loose a little bit and not have to worry about running over little children while they themselves are out on the floor cavorting around after having a, a, a nautical cocktail or something. The Dance Hall Nutcracker at Sea sets sail on December 11 and 12 with children's shows at 2.30 p.m. on Saturday and 11 a.m. and 3 p.m. on Sunday. The gala grown-up version, or the alcohol version, is on Saturday <laughs> night at 7 p.m. For more information, point your toes and web browsers to dancealongnutcracker.org. Heidi and Doug, thanks again for coming. Thanks for having us. Thank you, Raymond. Up next is my report on the Marriage Equality Bridge Walk, and you're watching Outlook Video.